Are you ready to supercharge your document signing process as we unlock the secrets of streamlining signatures using Zoho Sign in our step-by-step -step tutorial? Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more amazing content. Let me show you what steps you need to take for sending a document for signature in Zoho Sign. From the homepage, click on Send for Signatures. Drag the required file or add it from your desktop or cloud. Specify a document name and recipient's details such as email name. Select the recipient action from the drop-down list. The recipient needs to sign, approve or receive a copy or assign a host from your organization who will get the document signed in person from the signatory. Choose the delivery method via email or email and SMS. For sending a private note or setting up additional step for security, click Customize. Add as many recipients as you need by using the plus button under Recipients Details table. Enabling Send in Order allows you to send the document for signing one after the other upon action completed, meaning the second recipient will get the file only after the first one signed it. By tracking the rows, you can change the order. Click Add Me if you want to add yourself to a sign-in process. To remove someone from recipients list, click on Minus icon. More settings let you configure more details associated with the document. You may want to set the deadline for signing after which the recipients won't be able to access the file. Select the validity of the document, should it be valid forever or till specific date. Categorize the document by type by choosing the one from existing types or adding the new one. Define the folder where the document should be added and write down a description if needed. Click Continue when all details are specified. You will be redirected to the Document Preview page, where you can add the required form fields. To do that, select what recipient should fill in a specific field. Drag the field of the relevant format from the panel on the right and drop it onto the required positions in the document. After fields are added, click Send or Send Later if you need to save it. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for future updates, and if you have any questions or need further assistance, feel free to reach out to us at knowhow at customerization.ca. See you in the next video.